So how do we get him the card? Uh, we're still working on that hmm. one. Too bad you can't just put an envelope and slip it on his door, huh? Yeah, that, that, that would be nice mm -hmm. if you got any better ideas. In order for this to work, Victor's got to believe that he found the card himself. Like, I, I, I just wonder if Peter knew why Victor wanted to activate my condition. Well, that point is moot because Peter's dead. Dante, you are a genius. I know how we're going to get that tarot card to Victor. How? Peter's going to give it to him. Peter had personal effects, right? I mean, items that were with him at the time of his death, maybe a watch, wallet, keys. Yeah, sure. Yeah, they would have had all that collected off of him. That's standard procedure. And who would have that stuff now? WSB. As evidence? Uh, maybe at first, and then they would have gone through it and then passed it on to Peter's next of kin. Bailey, by way of Maxie. And we have to make that known to Victor. So that Victor then goes for Peter's belongings, thinking that the card that he's looking for to control you is among them. Sam, you're a genius. We have to get access to Peter's things and then plant the tarot card in there, and hopefully Victor finds it. Do you know anyone that would be able to help us? I might. I'll make a call. Thank you. We have a phone. Thanks. That will. Yep. That didn't sound good. Peter's belongings have already been delivered, and it's too late to recall the messenger. Okay, well, I will reach out to Maxie and see what I can find. It's not Maxie. Peter has stipulated a different executor for his estate. If you sign an initial. Who's this from? Everything you need to know is inside the box. Well, what is it? What's left of Peter? 